Welcome to evening prayer. O God, make speed to save us. O, o Lord, Lord, make, make haste, haste to help us. us. Blessed are you, Lord God, creator of day and night. To you be praise and glory forever. As darkness falls, you renew your promise to reveal us the light of your presence. By the light of Christ, your living word, dispel the darkness of our hearts that we may walk as children of light and sing your praise throughout the world. Blessed be God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Blessed, Blessed be, God be God forever. forever. There shall come forth a shoot from the stock of Jesse, and a branch shall grow out of his roots, and the Spirit of the Lord shall rest upon him, the Spirit of wisdom and understanding, the Spirit of counsel and might, the Spirit of knowledge and the fear of the Lord. He shall not judge by what his eyes see, or decide by what his ears hear, but with righteousness he shall judge the poor, and decide with equity for the meek of the earth. The wolf shall dwell with the lamb, and the leopard shall lie down with the kid, the calf, the lion, and the fatling together, with a little child to lead them. They shall not hurt or destroy in all my holy mountain, for the earth shall be full of the knowledge of the Lord as the waters cover the sea. Glory, Glory to, to the, the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and, and shall be forever. Amen. Amen. We pray that this evening may be holy, good and peaceful. Let us pray with one heart and one mind. As our evening prayer rises before you, O God, so may your mercy come down upon us to cleanse our hearts and set us free to sing your praise now and forever. Amen. Amen. Psalm 114 Tremble, O earth, at the presence of the Lord. When Jesus came out of Egypt, the house of Jacob, from a people of a strange tongue, Judah became his sanctuary, Israel his dominion. The sea saw that and fled. Jordan was driven back. The mountains skipped like rams, the little hills like young sheep. What ailed you, O sea, that you fled? O Jordan, that you were driven back. You mountains that you skipped like rams, you little hills like young sheep. Tremble, O earth, at the presence of the Lord, at the presence of the God of Jacob. Who turns the hard rock into a pool of water, the flint stone into a springing well? Tremble, Tremble O earth, at the presence of the Lord. Lord. Strike the rock of our hard hearts, O God, and let our tears of joy and sorrow mould us to bear the imprint of your love given in Christ, our risen Lord. All, All nations shall come and worship you, O Christ, and share in the feast of your kingdom. Great and wonderful are your deeds, Lord God the Almighty. Just and true are your ways, O ruler of the nations, who shall not revere and praise your name, O Lord, for you alone are holy. All nations shall come and worship in your presence, for your just dealings have been revealed. To, to the, the one who sits on the throne, and to the Lamb, be blessing and honour and glory and might, for ever and ever. Amen. All nations shall come and worship you, O Christ, and share in the feast of your kingdom. Reading is Acts, chapter 9, verse 32, to the end. Now as Peter went here and there among all the believers, he came down also to the saints living in Lydia. There he found a man named Aeneas, who had been bedridden for eight years, for he was paralysed. Peter said to him, Aeneas, Jesus Christ heals you. Get up and make your bed. And immediately he got up, and all the residents of Lydda and Sharon saw him, and turned to the Lord. 
Now in Joppa there was a disciple whose name was Tabitha, which in Greek is Dorcas. She was devoted to good works and acts of charity. At that time she became ill and died. When they had washed her, they laid her in a room upstairs. Since the day was near Joppa, the disciples, who heard that Peter was there, sent two men to him with the request, Please come to us without delay. So Peter got up and went with them, and when he arrived, they took him to the room upstairs. All the widows stood beside him, weeping and showing tunics and other clothing that Dorcas had made while she was with them. Peter put all of them outside, and then he knelt down and prayed. He turned to the body and said, Tabitha, get up. Then she opened her eyes, and seeing Peter, she sat up. He gave her his hand and helped her up. Then, calling the saints and widows, he showed her to be alive. This became known, known throughout Joppa, and many believed in the Lord. Meanwhile, he stayed in Joppa for some time with a certain Simon, a tanner. Fear not, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by name, and you are mine. Fear, Fear not, for I, I have redeemed, redeemed you. I, I have, have called, called you by name, and you are mine. When you pass through the waters... I will be with you. When you pass through fire, you shall not be burnt. I have called you by name. You are mine. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Fear not, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by name. You are mine. You have filled the hungry with good things and sent the rich away empty. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Saviour. He has looked with favour on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him. From generation to generation, he has shown strength with his arm, and he has scattered the proud in their conceit, casting down the mighty from their thrones and lifting up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and sent the rich away empty. He has come to the aid of his servant Israel to remember his promise of mercy. The promise made to our ancestors, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory, Glory to, to the Father, and, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. You, you have filled the hungry with good things, and sent the rich away empty. Father God, at this time we pray for peace, a peace that passes all understanding, a peace from you. We think of individuals, those who we know, those who are suffering, those who are ill, who are fearful and who are lonely. Father God, we just lift them all to you. And at this time we pray Father God, for those in Afghanistan and Haiti. Lord, it must break your heart to see what's going on. But Father God, we just pray for your hand of protection over these people. Lord, we, we think of those in local government, community leaders, all who provide local services, those who work with the young or the elderly schools, colleges and universities as they begin and start new terms. We pray for emergency and rescue organisations. Father God, be with all these people and we pray that you will have the, the power and the protection over these people. Lord, in your mercy, hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. 
almighty and everlasting God, you are always more ready to hear than we are to pray and to give more than either we desire or deserve. Pour down upon us the abundance of your mercy, forgiving us those things of which are con we are conscious are afraid and giving us good things which we are not worthy to ask. But through the merits and mediation of Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Amen. Our Ath Father in heaven, hallowed, hallowed be your name. name. Your, your kingdom come, come. Your, your will be done, done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all evermore. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be, be to, to God. God.